Aye, Captain, I'm looking forward to taking leave on Nova Atar. The museum there is supposed to be quite excellent. Lots of antique and one-of-a-kind machinery. Commander, are you certain it's not the Kazakhstanian cognac you're looking forward to? Do they make that there, laddie? I don't know. Why, Mr. Scott, I'm surprised at you, not knowing the location of a famous distillery. We invented that brandy, you know. Right. <laughs> of course you did. No, really. We did. No one would ever doubt you, Ensign, however... Sorry to interrupt, Captain, but we have an emergency call from the science vessel Demita. She's in orbit around Valkos 3. On screen. Captain Kirk, good to see you're in the area. You have an emergency, Commander Gelman? Well, I'm not sure, actually. Maybe more of a case of better safe than sorry. We're orbiting Balkos 3 to study the Balkosi, a race of people just entering their own Stone Age. We've only been here two days. Already, we've found some unusual data. But just a few minutes ago, during the deep geologic probing phase, we were suddenly scanned. Scanned? I thought the Balkosi were just developing. They are, Captain. And there haven't been any indications of old civilizations until now. The scan was also of extreme power. Following that, we detected a power source coming online. We'll send the coordinates along with all the other information we've gathered. I was a little concerned that we triggered an old defense mechanism. With the amount of information it pulled in its scan, we'd be an easy target. I've moved the Demeter to a higher orbit on the far side of the planet. Quite reasonable, Commander. We're on our way. Thank you, Captain. Kirk out. Approaching Balkus 3, Captain. Entering standard orbit. I have the coordinates for the power source that Demeter detected. Spock, come with me. Scotty, you have the con, Lieutenant. Ask Dr. McCoy to meet us in the transporter room. Yes, Captain. What the devil was that? An attack? While I cannot guarantee a lack of physical change, Doctor, we seem to be unharmed. I therefore conclude we have been scanned. Captain, are you all right? Sensors detected a burst of power followed by some sort of powerful transmission? According to Spock, we're in perfect health, Scotty. According to Spock? Never mind, Mr. Scott. Can you track the transmission to its destination? I'll give it a try, Captain, but it's like nothing I've ever seen before. It never is, Mrs. Scott. It never is. Kirk out. I guess you were right, Spock. Here I thought we were dead for a second. Doctor, that would have made conversation quite difficult. I was making a joke, Spock. Were you, Doctor? Gentlemen, gentlemen, I believe we have some business at hand. This place looks like Spock's dream world, doesn't it, Jim? In what way, Bones? No decorations, no life, nothing but machinery. Not even a picture of his mother on the wall. A picture of my mother here would be most surprising. However, if you are suggesting that construction was performed in an efficient manner, I would agree with your most logical conclusion. Remind me to check my blood for green tinges when we get back to the ship, Jim. You know, I've got the feeling this is bigger than it looks, and I don't mean just more space beyond this door. I cannot get an accurate reading, Captain, due to a force field. However, it appears to be a transmitter. Nothing unusual about that object, Captain. It is an unknown piece of equipment inside an energy field. The energy field around this scanning device prevents a detailed examination. This star is made from native minerals and shows the propensity to emit low-level light. It shows a high degree of machining, Captain. 
mineral compounds in the star are not native to the surrounding regions, which indicates that it has been imported. How can you be sure, Spock? It is extremely similar to synthetic corn blue sapphire. Oh. While alien in design, fairly obviously the control panel to the door. Quite simple, considering the appearance of the other machinery here. All that was needed was a power interrupt. The doors will only stay closed while power is on. Interesting. appears to be a distributive optic node. If you say so, Mr. Spock. 